This is The Lockpicking Lawyer, and what I have for you today is an ABUS Model 797 Key Lockbox. Now, as a general matter, ABUS has a fairly good reputation among lockmakers, at least when compared to the likes of Masterlock. And with many of their products, that reputation is well deserved. For other products, however, ABUS is no better than Masterlock, and this key lockbox is a great example. If we compare it to the Master Lock Model 5400D, we'll find the same largely cast zinc construction, though the Apis does have a steel back. We then have very similar dust covers protecting the code wheels. If we move to the inside, we will find mechanisms that are very similar holding the shackles closed, just spring-loaded little tabs. And finally, holding the doors closed are mechanisms that look very similar and seem to be functionally identical. Unfortunately, that means they can both be decoded and opened very quickly. I demonstrated that on the Master Lock in video 969, which I'll link below. Today, I'll show you the same on this ABUS. But first, we need to change the combination to something I don't already know. So let's put this into reset mode. And while this is facing away from me, we're going to scramble the code wheels. Okay, that should be enough. Now let's put it back to operating mode, close the door, and scramble those wheels one last time. Okay, I now have a box to which I do not know the combination. I'm going to take this thin shim of metal that I cut from 7,000 thick feeler gauge, place it in between the lock body and a code wheel, and hook it behind a thin bar that rests across the back of all of these code wheels. I am then going to pull it into the code wheels such that they bind and turn the wheels until I find a loose spot in the travel. When I find that loose spot, I have found the digit of the combination. Okay, it seems the combination is 2609. So, as you can see, this ABUS lockbox can be decoded and opened very quickly, and it's probably not something that I would rely upon to protect my keys. In any case, that's all I have for you today. If you do have any questions or comments about this, please put them below. If you like this video and would like to see more like it, please subscribe. And as always, have a nice day. Thank you.